like you ever felt. Are you listening? here back again once again and today people we are back for episode three of pokemon liquid Qu crystal in the last episode you guys we met our rival after he stole the pokemon we thoroughly whooped his ass went back to professor elm gave him the egg he told us to take the pokemon league challenge and that is what we are doing and in between episodes i did of course do some grinding i told you if i caught anything else you guys would be the first to know so Let's go ahead and take a look at the party. First up is a new member to the team. We have Lust. The Fampy. Lo I love everybody up to level 15. I was battling in between the routes. City. And they had level 10s. And that's kind of terrifying. So I wanted to be what I thought would be on par to take on Sprout Tower today. So we've got Fampy here. The move set is Tackle, Older Sleuth, Growl, and Defense Curl. I'm really hoping today that it's going to learn a uh, rollout or some kind of rock move. I know it's a ground type, but I'm assuming it's going to learn some kind of rock type move first. Fingers crossed. Then we have our Chikorita, Mod Nature, with the ability Overgrow. It is Rocket Tackle, Poison Powder, Razor Leaf, and Reflect. Uh, honestly, probably my favorite moves all so far. Then last but not least, we have our normal flying type, Spiro. Serious nature with the ability Keen Eye. And it is Rock the Moveset, Peck, Growl, Leer, and Fury Cutter. And like I said, today's episode, guys, we are going to go ahead and take on Sprout Tower. So if you are excited for that, make sure that you hit that like button down below because it definitely helps us gauge how you feel about today's episode. But before anything else, we need to buy some items. And of course, our mob did give us a nugget, and I battled all the trainers, so we got money right now. I am going to go ahead and buy some Pokeballs, because we're nothing without our balls. We're going to go ahead and buy 12. Then we're going to buy some potions, potion, 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 potions. Yeah, we'll buy like two antidotes. Because I'm not thinking we're going to get poisoned a lot right now, but uh, you, you never know. They might come in handy. And then three paralyzed heals, and then we will be good to go. All right, we, we out this bitch. We are out this bitch. So, when I, like I said, when I was grinding, the levels, like, they weren't bad at first. Like, um, the wild Pokemon started out, like, level 3 and so on. But, like, the first trainer battle was level 7. And that was against Youngster Joe. Okay, Youngster Joey, you're not that important. It's just Rattata. But, like, look at this. Like, honestly, nothing here gives a lot of experience. So, it took ever to grind. Like, it wasn't even fun but we made it through whoop there what too fucking far too fucking far and then this asshole over here he's got like a pidgey a charmander and a chop this this little this fucking cunt fucking purple haired cunt I was so close to adding hoot hoot to the team it, it came down to, like, who I thought was, like, I didn't want Pidgey because, like, how often do you see Pidgey used? Like, let's be honest. So then I thought, okay, Spiro and Hoot Hoot, they don't get used nearly as much. Um, I'm not super into the idea of using Spiro or Firo. Um, we'll just, we're just kind of seeing what happens for now. I'm trying to use different Pokemon than I usually use. So, I'm just... We're just kind of dipping our toe in and seeing if we can fuck this bitch. Uh, I haven't done any exploring in this town yet, so... 
Oh, shit. Who the fuck are... Who are you? Get out of my way. I have no idea who the fuck that was. But, uh, I guess let's see if we can find him. Uh, it looks like he's gone. Gone like a freight train, gone like yesterday, gone like a soldier in the Civil War bang bang. Like, gone like 55 kick. Like all the good things, you ain't never getting back. Let's take a look here and see if they have any items for us. Y'all, I'm not going to give voice to the characters that aren't important. I'll read their text, but they don't get a voice. There are odd patterns drawn on the walls of the ruins. They must be the keys to unravel the mystery of the ruins. Really? Would not have guessed that. Would not have guessed that at all. The ruins are over 1,500 years old, just like my mother. But it's not known why they were built or by whom. The, uh, was it, was it, does that have something to do with maybe the, the unknown? Could you say that, um, you know what? I almost said a terrible, terrible joke. But I caught myself. So, I'm going to go ahead and consider myself a winner because I didn't say it. Give me something. Ruins of Alf. A look and touch tourist site. What the fuck does that mean? I mean, I've gone to some questionable places that were look and touch, if you know what I'm saying. Egg. The shame. He won't let us go any further. I remember that from when I was a kid. Take that berry, though. All I know is sometimes a berry will save your life. Sometimes a berry will save your fucking life. Give me something. Fox to the violence Jim was a fine trainer. He inherited his father's gym and has done a great job with it. I wish we met Faulkner's dad. That'd be cool. Ghost rumored to appear in Sprout Tower. They said normal type Pokemon moves have no effect. They said right. We're just doing a quick exploratization of this town. The Pokemon you get in a trade grows quickly. But if you don't have the right gym badge, they may disobey you. Well, I would like to actively avoid that. What the fuck just happened? I'm looking for a bell sprout. Want to trade for what? For my Onyx? Nope. You just glitched us out by talking to you. I'm not fucking trading with you. Fucking kidding me? Fuck your rock snake dick Pokemon, motherfucker. Give me some, bitch. Give me some. Oh, we just talked to you. Okay. Sometimes I forget, guys. Okay. It's someday when we have cut, we'll get that item. It'll be glorious. That's just the school. I have no interest in going in there. In the air. Air. air, air. Oh, we got some bitches. She has the name of her favorite things to eat. For the nickname she gives her Pokemon. I mean... I mean, honestly, I've heard of worse Pokemon nicknames. What is this? Fucking turkey? I call my pigeon berry. That, that's, that's pretty fucking stupid. That's pretty fucking stupid, dumb bitch. All right, well, it's time. And since I'm guessing it's Bellsprout Tower, I can only assume that they're going to have Bellsprout. So, we'll go ahead and lead with Spiro. Not going to lie, it's the only reason I picked up Spiro is because of this area right here. However hard we battle, the tower will stand strong. They are all getting the same voice in here because they're all irrelevant as fuck. Sage Bob. Because when I think of a sage, I think of Bob. Oh, get the fuck out. Oh my god. Okay, so I thought they were going to be higher level than this based off of everything else. I apologize for being over leveled. Okay, well, 
This this is this is a thing now. I I thought they were gonna be higher level. Based off of like the trainers I was battling, it seemed like they were gonna be higher level than that. Went to the wrong place. Uh, I like that. Sorry, I had to make a quick change or any of that. Hell no, I don't want this Rattata. Rattata can suck the fast part of my ass and. In general, it's pretty fucking fat, so. We got the escape rope. Now we can piece the fuck out of here. We are standing on this tower. Here we express our gratitude to honor all Pokemon. That's adorable. Oh, here's the bell sprout. Ah, that's so stupid. I think we're going to be on par for like important battles, though. So, uh, I can't send out Fampy because uh, it's not going to appreciate a vine whip. See? Vampy would not appreciate one of those. Uh-huh. What's your growth on? I see you. Oh my god, this Chikorita misses more fucking attacks than any other fucking Pokemon I've ever had in my goddamn life. You s I'm getting triggered by a fucking Chikorita. And it's my Chikorita. Woo! Okay. Nope, not leaving you in because you can't fucking hit your attacks. Look how little Spiro is. I really like its sprite though. I'm not gonna lie, not gonna lie, not gonna lie. Oh well that's see that was level twelve. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We're not that over. We're like Zack Ryder, we're somewhat over. Now, this was like a 2012, 2010-2012-ish, I believe. We'd be, if we were Zack Ryder over, we'd be the most over guy in the company. You know, I would catch that, but I have so many Pokemon right now. Uh, I don't use X items, so, uh, hey, at least I can sell it. Considering that was level, if I didn't catch the level 7, there's no chance in hell of catching the level 4. God damn, you saw it from... Sway, the leaves in the wind. I wonder... I would never... If I was going to dedicate a tower to a Pokemon, it wouldn't be a Bellsprout. It'd be like... Fucking... Munchlax or some shit. My plan for the gym is, um... Level 16 or 17, I think. Because I know this game is supposed to be harder than normal. Like, I don't want to be over-leveled. But I th think that's around the area that I I would want to be. I really, really hope... Um... VMP becomes more viable than the gym. All I know is... Chikorita's not looking pretty for the next two gyms, I think. Is, that, is the next gym Bug? I think it's I think it's bug. 
So uh, Chikorita is not seeming very viable based off of that. But we're almost done with Sprout Tower, so hey, be pop A. All right. I trained to find enlightenment in Pokemon. Don't we all, though? I mean, really? Don't we all? Sage Feng. See, that is a sagely name. Not Sage Bob. Sage Feng. 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 What well, is level 12 belt? God damn. Never mind. Get the fuck out. My training is incomplete. I, I I would say so. You got shit on by a little Spiro. The Elder's HM lights, even pitch black darkness. So while I, I guess that hasn't changed, we're still gonna get fucking Flash. Don't know how useful that's gonna be, but hey, I mean, ain't no thing but a chicken wing, I guess. Bye bye. You know, it'd be different if like they made them each sprite slightly different, like during the battle animation, because how are we supposed to believe that every single guy here looks exactly the same? I'm just saying. Oh shit! We're switching it up. We got a ho ho. That that pack still does a lot of damage. Goodbye. Well, I know what happens next. There he is. You are indeed skilled as a trainer. As promised, here is your HM. But let me say this. You should treat your Pokemon better. The way you battle is far too harsh. Pokemon are not tools for war. Huh. He claims to be the elder, but he's super duper weak. It stands to reason, Super Duper. I never lose to fools who babble about being nice to Pokemon, Super Dupers. I only care about strong Pokemon, Super Dupers, and eggs. I really couldn't care less, Super Dupers, about weak Pokemon, Super Duper. Brodus, use the escape rope. I'm just gonna uh, scoop this up real quick. You don't see me. You don't see me. This Pokemon is, like, right in front of him. I don't want to alarm you, my guy, but you got bats in your building. You better get them out before the, they shut your ass down. So good of you to come here. Sprout Tower is a place of training. People in Pokemon test their bonds to put a bright future together. I... Of the final test. Allow me to check the ties between you and your Pokemon. Your Pokemon and you. What the fuck ever, ho? I like how he looks just like everybody else in here. Oh, shit. Okay. See, I thought we were in bad... You motherfucker. I probably... Admittedly should have healed up Divinic. Before we got into this. Okay, you can come out. Why don't you come out? Don't identify me, bitch. You don't know lust like that, fucking hoe. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, you bitch. You fucking bitch. And, okay. Oh. This. 
This is going well. I can heal up too, bitch. Come on. Come on, Lust. You can do this. Just a little owl. You can do this. Yeah. Well, I was hoping we'd get more experience than that. But I guess, like I said, it's just a little owl. Okay, this one's level 14. Oh, shit. Woo! That one was pretty close. Alright, so Divinic is good. Divinic is good to go to go in the gym. That's exactly where he wanted to be. He doesn't need any training. Ah, oh, excellent. You and your Pokemon should have no problem using this move. Take this Flash HM. I'm not gonna lie. I was hoping for something that didn't suck. Flash illuminates even the darkest of places. But, to use that in a battle, you need the badge from Violet's gym. Thanks, I, I guess, man. Let's pop this escape rope because I'm not walking all the way back. Well, let's go heal up. Here's my Pokemans. I'm going to need you to heal them up for me. Well, looks like the only thing left to do in this town is to take on the gym. But like we said, we're not quite where we need to be level-wise. But what we'll do to gauge if we're... Well, if you know our level idea is a good idea, we're gonna take on the first trainer in the gym. I see they didn't change his shitty ass gym design. Bird Keeper Kevin. Hmm. Okay. That wasn't that wasn't too bad. Damn! Didn't even the keyword is guts. Does your Pokemon have guts? Those here are training night and day to become bird Pokemon masters. His, the first guy was stronger than the second guy. What the fuck? Oh, don't ground me, bitch. Don't ground me. You know what? Ah... I kind of want to risk it, but I'm 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 kind of scared. I'm not gonna lie, because if Spiro goes down, we have no one. Sure, we have Fampy, and like I don't know. I just don't think Fampy's strong enough where he's at right now, and we can't Chikorita. We can't use it all. Because it's just based off of, you know, levels. So, uh, like I want to do it, I want to do it, do it, but I just don't think it's smart. Uh, oh.
right, guys, we're going to wrap up today's episode right here, right now. Nice and cliffhanger. In the next episode, of course, we will take on Faulkner and make our way down to the next town. Probably clear out the cave, hopefully. As long as everything goes, either we'll get them clearing out the cave or that route. Because there's there's a couple traders between the, here and there. But if you guys enjoyed the episode, <coughs> I apologize. If you enjoyed the episode, please show your support. Smash that like button down below. If you're not already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe for more of that good content. And you know me. No Vatican hero. Representing the house of No Vatican on reality and play. And I will see you guys in the next one.